Now I'm going to show you how to transfer your Google Play Music Library over to YouTube Music. Um, this should transfer over any songs or playlists you have, so however you have everything organized should come over, as well as any songs you've personally uploaded to your Google Play Music Library should also transfer over to YouTube Music um, without any problems, hopefully. So the first thing you need to do is download the YouTube Music app, which a link for it will be in the description below. Once you do that, open up the app and log into the same Gmail account that you have tied to your Google Play Music account. Um, you need to use the same Gmail account. Once you do that, you should hopefully um, come to the main page here in the YouTube Music app and then you should see this section down here that says transfer your um, play music library. If you don't see it there, there's one other place you can check, and that's if you tap on your user in the top right. Go to settings, and if you scroll down, you'll see this option here that says transfer from Google Play Music. If neither of those options are showing up, don't worry. Um, Google is slowly rolling out this feature, so it could take a few weeks or maybe even longer um, for those options to pop up under your account in YouTube Music. So just check back every few days or every few weeks, and eventually it'll pop up and be there. So I'm going to tap the Let's Go button here. And here you can say, this is what it's going to transfer. It's going to transfer music recommendations, your playlists, and any stations or anything you've saved, uploaded and purchased music. So again, any music you've personally uploaded um, to your Google Play Music Library or any songs you've purchased, albums and songs in your library, and memberships and current pricing. So if you do something, if you uh, pay for YouTube music so you get you know unlimited music each month and you pay for that subscription that subscription is gonna come over to YouTube music and work pretty much the same so I'm gonna select start transfer and here you go it's gonna transfer your music library and it may take a few hours it says it'll let you know when it's finished in the meantime start exploring YouTube music so this could even take more than a few hours uh, Google has posted you know it might take a day or so um, but once that's done um, I'll come back here and I'll show you guys what it looks like once it's all transferred and ready to go So it's finished transferring all of my music and playlists and everything over to YouTube Music. And you see I've got a notification here that says it's complete. So I'm going to go ahead and tap on the notification. And you can see at the top it says from your Play Music Library, which I'm sure it's going to have a ton of stuff because it moved everything over. And like if I go to the library in the bottom right, So in this screen, if I tap on my playlists, these are all my playlists that I have. And it looks like all of them have transferred over from my Play Music account. So that's awesome. So you can see it should have transferred pretty much everything over. Like even if I go to songs, it just shows kind of everything. Um, you can also see uploaded, so that's anything you've personally uploaded to like Google Music or now YouTube Music, you can do that same, the same kind of thing, and you'll see all the songs that are kind of in YouTube Music will pop up here. And you can see recently added, or you can sort them by A to Z. So there's all my songs. If I go back... Um, and if you do albums, I'm sure it's going to look pretty much the same. Um, so yeah, it looks like everything has transferred over. I can go back home. Um, so all of my music has transferred over from Google Play Music to YouTube Music. Um, I'll probably have to go in and, and re-download stuff if I want to. Um, if you have any 
if you had any downloaded playlists or anything like that on Google Play Music, you'll have to go and redo that stuff here if you want to, but you should be good to go. Hopefully that helps. Thanks for watching that video. If you liked it, make sure you give it a thumbs up and go ahead and click that subscribe button so you can get notified about other helpful tech videos I post to the channel. Thanks for watching.